hi everyone and a welcome to my channel so today i have for you a dollar tree haul i went to the dollar tree in freeport texas and i found a few items that i thought i would share with each of you so we'll hop right in i'm gonna show you everything that i purchased so for starters i picked up a new food item this is idahoan jalapeno cheddar home style casserole I thought this would be a good addition as a side dish to maybe some baked chicken, something along those lines. You get four servings per container. So picked that up. Next, I picked up this a really cute a little sign. It says gather. It is gray, you know, with the white and the black. Super farmhouse. Um, I just thought it was really cute. It even has a little bead, a little bead detail on it. So I thought that was super cute. There is two other ones um, similar to this that go with the set, but I just chose to pick up the one. I thought it would be, like I say, cute on, on one of my shelves. Next, I picked up some um, of these sticker wall decors. I love these little girls. Um, super um, cute. Um, inclusion. They have all the different um, little girls on here. And I just thought they were super cute. I made a cute layout in my planner. I like to use these for my planner. And since we do live on the coast, I thought this would be cute. So picked that up. Next, I picked up this Minions um, set. Cute. Like I say, I use these in my planner. Um, these are really large stickers. So they, they work just really well in my planner. So... That's what I get those for. Cute. Next, I picked up this frozen um, Elsa keychain. I want to put this on my little niece's Christmas, um, no, my little niece's birthday present um, on her bag. So I picked that up. They had Olaf and they had um, Anna. This is Elsa. They had Anna and Olaf yes so cute next i picked up a new magnet it says live every day like it's live every day like it's taco tuesday we're from south texas and i know we love our tacos here and um so that was cute i have a lot of these magnets on my um desk at work we have upper shelves that are metal and um so i have a lot of these magnets on there and uh, that would be a great addition to uh, that collection next i picked up uh, these football forms i'm not too big into football but my oldest daughter loves her uh, dallas cowboys so maybe i'll do a craft with these who knows um, but I thought it would be cute, um, to do a little something for her. You can either do it, you know, like it's intended, or you can put them together and make like a whole football. So picked those up. They are by Floral Garden and they are the football wreath form. Next, I picked up these Main Street Wall Creations. These are pill and stick removable tiles. And these are so awesome. Look how pretty that is. I picked up two of them. I thought these would be really nice. Like if you were doing a craft where you were making like a, a tray or something that these may look like really nice in the bottom of them. So I picked up two of that style. This was probably my favorite. This style with that metallic in there. So nice. Picked up two. And then the last of these, and this one's really pretty as well. Um, two of those. So I thought these would just be great to have in the stash for anything. Um, you could maybe even use these if you were, you know, making like a um, Barbie house. Like if you were redoing, you know, your Barbie house or um, 
I, I don't know. There's so many possibilities, but these are really pretty and really nice quality. So I picked those up. Next, I picked up two DVDs. The Freeport store had a whole um, table full of uh, DVDs and Blu-rays. So I picked up the Lucy Show is the official first season. Um, it's really a heavy quality. It says you get 30 shows. Um, I was going to open it so we can look inside of it. Goodness. Okay. All right. Here we go. Special features. Interview with uh, Lucy. Uh, interview with Jimmy Garrett. Opening uh, clips from the opening night special, vintage openings, vintage closings, cast commercials, vintage network promos, flubs, cast biographies, production notes, and the Lucy Show vintage merchandise. So, how cool is that? Okay, kind of came apart there. Here it goes. And uh, man, for a buck, and you get all of this. Well, it came out, but you get one, two, three, four, four separate discs. That is really nice. I'm impressed. It doesn't want to stay in its little holder, but that's really a cool deal. So, picked that up. Lucy was hilarious. Oh goodness, I'm sorry guys. Whew, that was that was a whole lot. The next one I picked up is a double feature is Peanuts movie. It's Snoopy Come Home, which was kind of a sad movie. And then a boy named Charlie Brown. So let's see if I can open this. Hope everyone is having an amazing Saturday. Here we go, and yep. So that is cool. This is, does it even say how long it is? I don't see how long it says. So anyway, I was excited to find these. They had a lot. I'm not really, um, too much in the movie so I don't know really what is a good movie and not so good movie so I just picked up the ones that I know that I know a little something about and that was really the only two that I saw so um, other people can probably find a lot more movies next I picked up these this one says family these are cute for like a wreath or just to hang on your wall paint them I would probably spray paint them so that you can get in all those um you know deep inside and if you want to go over the top with um a um, chalk paint that may be easier but i liked that i got family i picked up gather these are diy decor here's this tag for them really cute and then the last one that i picked up says thankful so um picked those up next i picked up this witch's hat a wreath of form and um hopefully i'll have time to, to make something with this so super cute um, and then uh, last but not least i picked up two of these rugs these are really nice. Um, here is the the tag for them. I love these. Um, I bought two of them. I bought one to put in the uh, dog's area so that I um, can place his uh, water bowl on it. I may use this for that. Also, I bought him a placemat 
So we'll see what I decide, but I picked that one up. And then the second one, I think I may put in the bathroom over the side of the tub. That way when I get out, I can just step on this. And um, this is easier to wash and thinner than it is to wash the whole rug. So I think I'm just gonna use this. And I bet this is really super absorbent. It's really a pretty thick quality. So I think that's the way I will use those. And um, so anyway, guys, that is it. I did have two things to show y'all in uh, my last uh, previous haul. I had picked up this little two pack of um, button pocket enclosures. And I said I had wanted to put my monthly bills in this. And um, so it does fit in here very nicely. Uh, my, my bigger receipts that are like, um, you know, a paper, they fold in half and they do fit nicely in here. And then I just take uh, my receipts and I just, you know, put the date on the top of them so that they are in um, order. And then I can just store them in this, this little envelope all month. And then at the end of the month, I can just clip them all together into my big binder clip for the whole year. So a great way to store your receipts, keep them all together for the month. And then um, if y'all remember in a previous haul, I picked up this a really cool um, soap dish, but I started noticing it looks like it's like cracked. See how it is like, like it's, it cracks or something. If anyone else had bought this and theirs is doing that, let me know. I, I, I saw it happening in the bathroom. So I took it to the kitchen yesterday and I scrubbed it with, uh, you know, the dishcloth, the dish sponge and some Dawn and left it in the kitchen overnight to see. And uh, today it's finally starting to, to crack back again. I just, I don't understand. That is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. And it's like, if you like push it back, I don't know if y'all can see that on my finger, in my finger, um, but it's like, let's see. It's like something, like you can like scratch it off and it's like crust. Anyway, there's not enough on here to, to show y'all what I'm talking about, but that like, it's like raised up. I don't know. It's strange. The kind of the soap I have in here is Bath and Body Works. I just poured it into this from the Bath and Body Works dispenser. So anyway, guys, I'm just curious if you have this, if yours is doing that too. I really love it. It's really cute. It looks really good in the bathroom, but that Kraken is just like got me puzzled. Anyway, guys, that is my haul. Um, my Dollar Trees just have not had very many items. In fact, I went to the one in Clute. I walked out with nothing. I went to the one in Lake Jackson, and I walked out with nothing. The Freeport store is the only store that I found anything, and I actually have been to it two times just to have enough things to show y'all this. So, anyway, I hope y'all are finding more um, items at your local stores than I am having luck finding at mine. But anyway, guys, I hope you're enjoying your Saturday. I met my niece and great nephew and we went and had sushi for lunch. Stop by Bath and Body Works. If you are needing lotion or candles or what, they are still having their, their um, sale. The candles are half off right now and some of their other products are. So got me some more candles. They have brought out all their Halloween candles and um, different soaps for Halloween and all that. So anyway, guys, y'all take care. Stay, stay safe. We are um, on the dirty side of a category one um, hurricane um, that's going to be making landfall a little bit south of here. So it has been a little bit ugly as the bands um, are coming ashore. And, um, but I don't expect us to have much more than a rain here. So anyway, that is what we're doing. If we get some bad weather, I may go outside and sit on the porch and film some for y'all 
um, we'll see how it, how, what happens as it comes ashore. Anyway, guys, y'all take care. And if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, become part of my friends here on YouTube and y'all have an amazing day. Bye.